What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel and today we're checking out, I honestly don't know what we're checking out. This video was sponsored by a Cheryl. Cheryl, I don't know your last name, but thank you. Cheryl wrote this note. Please check out Jackson Brown's The Loadout. It's actually two songs they always play together, The Loadout and Stay. Only a Cretan would ask for only one part of the performance. No idea what that context means, but my one of my favorite things we have done in this channel is check out things that I have not just like heard of, but never really listened to, but I have never heard of Jackson Brown. American singer, songwriter, and political ad uh, activist. Seems to have been a, a songwriter first for others. Then he started uh, releasing his own stuff. He was born in Germany. Seems to be a guy with fantastic intentions. Um, we checked out on this channel for the first time, Crosby, Stills, and Nash, and he seems like he's friends with them. He's won multiple, he's been nominated for multiple Grammys. So I guess we're checking out a legend today. So we'll see. As I just take a quick look through the comments on this video that we're checking out, the link is in the description. People just love it. And apparently I need to uh, listen out and look out for some David Lindley, an American musician who founded the rock band El Rayo X. Word. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for coming to hang out. You're helping out the channel just by, by watching and hanging out. And hopefully this is fun for you too. Um, hitting like and subscribe that all helps out as well and if you want to help out like Cheryl did in getting this video put together there's a lot of people who have helped out the channel and sent with that requests time um, is not allowing for us to get to all of them as fast as we would like but to all of you who have helped out thank you it helps us continue to do to do this channel so here we go Jackson Brown the loadout and stay this is 1978 <laughs> Great hair. Great hair. Thank you. People love it already. Now the seats are all empty. Let the roadies take the stage. Peace. Pack it up and tear it down. He's German. Now the first to come and the last to leave. Work out for that minimum wage. They'll set it up in another town. Tonight the people were so fine. Nice. They waited there in line. Oh, I love that sound report. On their feet, they made the show. And that was sweet. But I can hear the sound of slamming doors and folding chairs. And that's a sound they'll never know. I roll them cases out and lift them in. Haul them trusses down and get them up the ramps Cause when it comes to moving me You know you guys are the champs but When that last guitar's been packed away You know I still want to play So just make sure you got it all set to go Before you climb for this piano yeah. Let's pause this really quick and I just love the feeling that I'm getting. We say this for every video that we check out from like live performances from like this era and everything similar, but bro, it makes me yearn for more and more musicians from my era or just that are coming out today to just perf like 
to just be real performers. It requires a lot more talent, but also the flaw that comes in a real, genuine performance makes you feel things that you wouldn't feel otherwise. It's It sounds like it's a song he, that he wrote about tra being a traveling musician and what it's like to to just stay behind while you're still packing up after after their performance and people leave everything that you're doing to to pe keep it going but that line there at the end of that chorus when that last guitar has been packed away you know that i still want to play so just before you got it all set to go before you come for my piano it seem it, it seems like he's expressing his gratitude that he's doing something that he loves and still loves to do it maybe i don't know Oh, that sounds so good. I think this is that David Lindley dude. But the bed oh, beautiful. Nice. Oh, Detroit, I don't know. We do so many shows in a row, and these towns all look the same. We just pass the time in our hotel rooms and wander around backstage till those lights come up and we hear that crowd and we remember. Nice. What a good beat drop, bro. And I love the beats from this era, man. Give it to me, dude. lyrics actually jeez you know that you can't go wrong cuz when the morning sun comes beating down you're gonna wake up in your town dude that sliding that guitar sounds fantastic a thousand miles away from here people stay Okay. So they merged. We want to play. Yeah. Just a little bit longer. Oh, don't mind. And the union don't mind. Nice. Layers. A little time and we leave it all behind. Say, one more song. We're gonna let her finish here and pause.
See, I'm glad I was sort of warned that these are two songs because I wouldn't have I wouldn't have caught the fact that they just that they did that. It's just like you can feel, especially as you listen to the 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 words, these words that he's written. He just loves performing for people. Just one more song. He's just just expressing his gratitude and how much he loves this connection with people. Live performances and, and witnessing a musician. It's almost like a religious, spiritual experience. There's something elevating us to want something higher and it's done through music and it's engaging and entertaining beautiful i don't know how else to describe it what the I just feel like this is supposed to be funny. It sounds like the Beach Boys. That actually was pretty impressive. Take a little time, leave it all behind. Sing one more song. Going through like some other comments, it seems like David Lee passed. There you go. Peace. Just such a positive it, it makes me want to just go to a live performance more than anything which is great that david lindley dude technically theoretically technically crushed that part uh, it wouldn't be the first uh, i'm glad it was as short as it was no no offense i found it funny but then when he gets back on that sliding guitar bro beautiful jackson brown is in the rock and roll hall of fame ah oh, man yeah it just makes you crave just real music we're as a people we're starving for just real real uh, leaders real musicians real just real it's amazing what being real does and can do for you didn't think we would get a life lesson out of watching something like this but th there's there's our message for us yeah there are some things that i think we all wish were different about us flaws in our character and things like such that we wish we didn't have but we do have them so if we just own up to them and don't lie about them and don't keep them from people it's almost like we give those things less power and we keep becoming more and more the, the people that we are destined to be. And then in the meantime, more people are drawn to you because at least you're just keeping it real. As Dave Chappelle taught us, just gotta, just keeping it real. Comment down below if you got that reference. Well, thank you so much for, for spending some time with me. And to all of you, especially who are sharing uh, your passion for your mu the music of your generation, thank you so much for enlightening me. Much love, everybody. Till the next.